and action. In his new film, Before Sunrise, acclaimed director Richard Linklater explores the potential for romance in a relationship that develops over the course of a single night. Ethan Hawke plays a young American traveling through Europe, and Julie Delpy is the French girl he encounters on a train. I think myself and almost everyone I know has had kind of these whirlwind romance things where you, you meet someone and you talk and you kind of explore another person like this. All right, I have an admittedly insane idea, but if I don't ask you this, it's just, uh, you know, it's gonna haunt me the rest of my life. What? I wanna keep talking to you, you know? I have no idea what your situation is, but, uh, but I feel like we have some kind of uh, connection, right? Yeah, me too. Yeah, right, well, great. So listen, here's the deal, this is what we should do. You should get off the train with me here in Vienna and come check out the town. It's so rare, you know, to have two people who are really sharing something, and that's what it's about, and that's why I think Celine follows him. It's, you know, because she feels, you know, there's a chance maybe to say something and to know something more about some, somebody else. It's a movie about men and women trying to get along with each other. I think that appeals to everybody. I think everybody's got a stake in that. <laughs> this is kind of weird. Yeah, it's kind of weird, isn't it? I mean, it's a little awkward. Um, <laughs> But it's all right, right? It's yeah, okay. this is great. This yeah. is great. Let's go to some places. Look yeah. at your book. We're in Vienna. Let's go to some places. We wanted a new, a new place, cinematically speaking. So Vienna fit all of the elements because it certainly, when you walk around here, it just smells of European city. And I think we all thought from the beginning that if you could key into at least what I went through and what a lot of people went through when they, when they're in college and they're they're in a foreign country for the first time and the sense that anything can happen, that it would make it a more magical story. We got, uh, we got a sunset here. Yeah. We got the Ferris wheel. Yeah. Seems like um, this would be uh, Are you trying to say you want to kiss me? It's really about trying to articulate how hard it is for two people to meet each other and how hard it is for two people to get along and for how hard it is for people to talk to each other and how hard it is for people to be intimate with each other. All the things that are actually really going on in your lives. You can live with someone for 10 years and don't know this person. And I think this film is about in one night they're going to try to know each other more than if they've been together for a long time. You know? Now I'm going to call my best friend in Paris who I'm supposed to have lunch with in eight hours. Okay? Okay. Dring, dring. Pick up. What? <laughs> Pick up the phone. Uh, oh, hello. I don't think I'm going to be able to make it for lunch today. I'm sorry. I, I met a guy on the train, and I got off with him in Vienna. We're still there. Why'd you get off the train? Well, he convinced me. I mean, actually, I was, <laughs> I was ready to get off the train with him after talking to him a short while. He was so sweet, I couldn't help it. Maybe the film is going to seem like we did improvisation. No way, you know, there's not one scene where there's improvisation, you know, it's all written. I even told them that, you know, no one's even going to appreciate your performance. They're going to think, hey, we just turned on the camera and you were just yourself and oh, it's so easy. And I'm like, that's the ultimate compliment you'll ever get and don't be frustrated by it because no one will ever know how hard you worked on this. After tomorrow morning, we, we're probably never going to see each other again, right? You don't think we'll ever see each other again? What do you think? They have to be believable. They have to be falling in love constantly. They have to be, like, keep a flirty and edge. It's a huge acting adventure for them. But, I mean, they've both been so up for it. I mean, they're so energetic and they're kind of burning inside both of them so much. So it's, it's, it's wonderful to watch. Do you know what I want? What? To be kissed. Well, I can do that. Before Sunrise. Playing this month only on Warner TV. The world's best television.